Yeah. I'm Jim Bennett, this is my wife Lexi Bennett. The idea of Bennett Farms uh, came to me in the form of a dream. We, uh, we were planning to take our daughter to a pumpkin patch. She was two at the time. Um, and we, uh, I woke up thinking if you plant it, they will come like on Field of Dreams, it was just in my head. And I would uh, trace my thoughts back to see what I was dreaming about. And it was about taking Avery to a pumpkin patch, our daughter. And we just, uh, I woke up that night and woke up Lexi and I said, I'm gonna start a pumpkin patch. I started writing down my ideas to kind of formulate a plan and put it together. And we opened up that following fall. My grandfather, Hugh Bennett, was really my driving ambition in this whole project. He, uh, he gave me some of the ideas that we incorporated, the way we cook, as far as uh, cooking the way people used to cook and teaching kids about farm related activities. Um, but I, got, I was able to tell my grandfather about the project before we started, um, but he passed away the year before, I mean, the year that we opened. So we opened in October, he passed away in February, but uh, he was my driving ambition in the whole project and, and still is. I mean, he is, he's the reason that I, I know how to do a lot of things I know how to do and uh, my work ethic. Um, it's all a direct correlation of, of my relationship with my grandfather. The staff that we have has been with us from the beginning. I mean, they're like our family. We've got a lot that have been with us from day one. And uh, the weekends we have a lot of high schoolers and they're a lot of fun. They probably keep us young and they become our, our best friends. But during the week we have a lot of um, family and friends that work with us. And uh, we all just look forward to working with each other for the month and uh, we just really enjoy the time we have together. We'll have people here before we open the gates uh, on Saturdays and we've had some that'll come in at first when we open the gates and we'll see them when we're closing okay. closing the gates. A Saturday is full of activities, we have a lot of music um, and of course food is one of our biggest pulls. We, uh, we do sell a lot of food and, and it's very unique the way we cook over open fire and uh, our barbecue, our brisket, our pork skins, tea cakes. Um, I think food's really a big pull, especially on Saturdays when people want to spend a lot of time. We love it when people do that. They're able to come, they eat, they uh, of course do all the activities, leave here with pumpkins, and um, you can tell that they've had a big time and kids are all wore out. So to us, that's a, that's a win.